On this edition of Furman Soccer Today, we'll recap the Project Pinwheel Jamboree that had Furman play South Carolina foes, Newberry, and Limestone. We'll also talk about Furman Soccer's commitment to stopping child abuse, and we'll visit Furman Soccer's Professional Development Day. On March 23rd, Furman faced off against Newberry College. The Paladins defeated the Wolves 3-0 in a contest that featured goals scored by Martin Ontiveros, Tyler Peoples, and Kevin Paul. On the first goal, Ontiveros scored a well-placed shot to the left corner off a Josh Fuzan assist. On the second goal, the Newberry goalkeeper bobbled a shot and Tyler Peoples put in the rebound to put the Paladins up 2-1. to one. On the third goal, Chris Duggan had the pick of the night with a curling shot from distance. In the other contest, Furman drew limestone in a 1-1 -to -one game that featured a goal scored by Tyler Peoples with an assist from Josh Fusan. This year's Spring Jamboree was dedicated to Project Pinwheel, which is an organization in Greenville dedicated to stopping child abuse. Furman Soccer planted pinwheels out in front of the Stone Soccer Stadium in honor of this occasion because the pinwheels represent a happy childhood. Members of the Furman and Greenville community came out in full force to support Project Pinwheel's fight against child abuse and to cheer for the Paladins. When its Technical Graphics Division, based in Greenville, South Carolina, hosted Furman Soccer for Professional Development Day. The day's focus was on developing the players' skills going into the professional world. The players learned how to develop a resume, network, and were even subject to mock interviews. And like any other student, Furman soccer players know the value of finding a career path. Thank you for watching Furman Soccer Today. Tune in next time as we preview Furman's Earth Day Soccer Extravaganza and Alumni Weekend.